Ohio is starting to open back up this week, but many of the businesses and organizations that we rely on every day look different. News 5's Kevin Berry found one foundation making sure the nonprofit work in and around Cleveland has a chance to rebound with Northeast Ohio, even when fundraising is down. Like millions of Americans who are now unemployed, Deanna had a job before the coronavirus outbreak that provided for her and her daughter. Then, manufacturing facilities like hers shut down as the outbreak got more serious. They said, hey, you know, we're going to unfortunately let you guys go. We're going to let you know when we will be reopening and positioning you guys as such. So In her you, moment of need, Deanna basically. turned to the nonprofit Towards Employment. That group helps people like Deanna not only pull together a resume, but learn job skills and how to become a better employee. Deanna says Towards Employment helped her start her career in the first place. Without Towards Employment, I would probably have no skill set. But right when Deanna needed help, so did the organization she turned to. Jill Rizica runs Towards Employment. Some of our funding streams, you know, continue, but others have dropped off <laughs> dramatically while the need is still there. That's when the philanthropy arm of Union Home Mortgage, which is headquartered in Strongsville, decided to step in. Well, Executive Director Christina Bank, Fagan uh, says normally the Union Home Mortgage Foundation gives out grants four times a year. The coronavirus created a new and more sudden need. We decided to open up a brief two week window um, to nonprofits that we had supported in the past but to give them some extra funding with no restrictions on the dollars. Christina says it'll help some nonprofits keep doing their work during and after the outbreak. That's true at Towards Employment, where Jill says they're gearing up for a hectic return to work with record unemployment right now and plenty of workers who still need new skills. This is not going away. Building these digital skills, giving them the tools is something that is going to be essential even as we move forward. In the meantime, the organization helped Deanna find a temporary job until she can get back to the one she had before the outbreak, helping Deanna keep her job, provide for her and her daughter, and set a good example along the way. She's understanding that I have her best interests at heart at, at all times, even when I even when I have her do a little bit of math. <laughs> so. I'm Kevin Barry, News 5.